Welcome to the Spiration Valve System Valve Deployment in Service. Today, we will review the proper steps for deploying the Spiration Valve. While using a bronchoscope with a working channel of 2.6 or larger, carefully insert the loaded catheter into the instrument channel of the bronchoscope until the tip of the catheter is just visible. Important! Do not bend or force the distal end of the catheter while inserting it into the bronchoscope. Under bronchoscopic observation, advance and position the bronchoscope so that the target airway location is visible and the tip of the catheter can be directed into the target airway site without bending or kinking the catheter. Advance the catheter so that the yellow valve line passes beyond the target location using the same angle as the sizing balloon. While directing the catheter to the target airway site, do not apply excessive force to advance the catheter, as this could kink the catheter or result in a premature deployment. Pull the catheter back slowly so that the yellow valve line is at the target location. The valve line marks the position where the proximal end of the valve will contact the airway wall once deployed. After deployment, the valve may settle distally over time, so the bronchoscopist should account for this effect when planning where to measure and deploy the valve. Hold the catheter sheath at the instrument channel entry port and remove the green safety clip. Set the safety clip aside for later use. Using a smooth, continuous motion, pull on the catheter retractor to deploy the valve. Once the valve is completely deployed, immediately remove the catheter from the bronchoscope. Visually examine the valve for position and fit. The valve should be opened and opposing against all borders of the airway. Evaluate the reduction of the air leak and determine if additional valves should be deployed. If at any point the position of the deployed valve is not optimal or appropriate, remove and dispose of the valve. To prepare the catheter for the next valve deployment, hold the catheter uncoiled and advance the catheter retractor forward until all of the yellow portion of the handle is exposed. Reinstall the green safety clip over the yellow portion of the deployment handle.